Hey everybody, it's Brant Frost. I hope y'all are doing well. I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. And now we're just about in the final stretch of this campaign for the runoff on December 6. We have early voting starting on Monday, so we all need to get out and work as hard as we can. We've got folks coming from all over the country to help us. Just in my neck of the woods alone, we've got volunteers coming from Alabama, from Texas, North Carolina. We're looking to get to getting some from Tennessee. It's really, really good stuff, folks. And I'm just so thankful for all the friends who've come from far and near to help us in this effort. We're gonna to continue to be working on recruiting poll watchers. And many of you in your own counties volunteered to help out in that or went to another county, such as Fulton or DeKalb County to help in that. We're so grateful for that. So grateful for the leadership of our local Republican parties working tirelessly to recruit and train poll watchers. In some cases, needing to recruit hundreds of poll watchers and potential poll watchers for just one or two counties. It's a huge task and we're very grateful for the leadership of our teams in those counties. Also wanted to thank y'all for participating in our issues and candidates survey, and the results of that will actually be sent out uh, in the link with the email that you'll be watching this video on, or if you're watching it by itself on YouTube, there'll be a link to the survey results in the description of the video. We appreciate your participation in that. It's always good to hear from you. Also, I wanted to let y'all know, of course, as we're coming into early voting, to please get everyone you know who can early vote to please do so. If they can't get an early ballot, if they can't go in and early vote in person, that is, you should have them go and vote um, through the absentee process. It's very important that we get this done. As we saw in Maricopa County, when election day is where Republicans are voting and the Democrats are voting during the, all the early voting time, it can be very difficult if the elections uh, system breaks down or has any serious problems, if lines develop and people just drive by the polling station because they see the lines too long and they just say, ah, forget it. I'll go later and then they don't. So it's vital that we early vote. I was talking to a volunteer just today and she was saying that she's heard Republicans who've never early voted saying that they're gonna early vote in this election. So that's a really good sign. It's a sign of both energy on our side because this is a turnout election, folks. Uh, if you look at the numbers, Stacey Abrams got far less votes than Herschel Walker did. This is a turnout election. Their base, their hardcore supporters who voted for Stacey, and we have our base, our hardcore supporters who are supporting Herschel. If our base turns out, we can win this election. So I wanna thank each and every one of you for what you're doing, for what you continue to do. Onward to victory, folks. It's a lot to be done, but let's win this because the Democrats think they've got this in the bag. And if we beat them, when we beat them on December 6th, it's gonna wipe the smirk off Chuck Schumer's face and it's gonna raise the spirits of Republicans not only in Georgia, but all across the land. Let's make it happen, folks. And then let's get Joe Manchin to switch sides and now we'll have a Republican-controlled Senate. It can be done, folks, but we have to win in Georgia. Let's make it happen. God bless.